a huge fan of your work you know you. Through, through Mean Creek you know I love that and the fact that you're such a big part of Film Independent Thanks. I love Film Independent all things Film Independent yes yeah. you know I mean I've been a member of Film Independent since before it was ever Film Independent me too when it was um, it was fine film and right, before right. that that's it was right. another entity right. and I am the only person who's covered every single LA Film Festival oh, that's great thank you for doing that I'm the one <laughs> Well, thank you for making this film. This is absolutely charming. It is adorable. It is sweet. I mean, it's four paws up as far as I'm concerned. You know, what did when this script came to you? When this, how early on did you get involved? Not early. This is the first time I've not developed a script that I've produced, and so uh, Finn and I had met years earlier on another project that didn't get made, and um, he literally sent it to me on a Thursday and said, I'd like you to start on Tuesday. Will you come produce this for me? And I read it and thought, okay, two things. A, you should sell this script for a billion dollars because it's such a beautiful conceptual high-end movie and he's like I'm directing it and I'm like I know I know but I just thought I'd give you a shot at millions of dollars and now um, he wanted to direct it and I came up and we cast the film together and I put together the budget and then we shot everything in Berkeley his hometown and my family's in San Francisco as well so because you came into this project so late did you have any kind of trepidation about it when you're not there with your hands in it from the beginning? I didn't because the script was solid, so I was in. And I, I thought Finn had such a um, beautiful, um, what's the word? I just liked his, I liked the way he worked. I liked his philosophy on film and, you know, that you're out there to entertain people and make people happy and we're at a time where you need to make people happy and everyone's looking for something to inspire them and I thought this was that movie so you know, and the thing is this movie it makes you happy you watch it and you're happy it ends and you're happy yeah, and definitely it does it, uh, hopefully everybody will walk away um, feeling inspired you know, and something that's a standout in this film even more so than with your others the production design and cinematography here are mind-blowing for an indie film you know, it's, it's beautifully done. In 23 days we shot this movie um, all around San Francisco, which is hard to shoot in. It's so busy and full of tourists, especially in the summer when we shot. And uh, Rich and Rob did an amazing job, cinematographer. And, and of course, I got to ask, how hard was it to bring your music in? with budget because your musical selections are, are fabulous. The music is all Finn and Linda Cohen who's our music supervisor and then Jenny Scheiman and Mark Orton wrote this uh, the soundtrack and um, Finn has a very specific had very specific music in his head from the very beginning we just didn't think we could afford it and so it was a matter of like testing the film and convincing the investors that it made sense to have that kind of a soundtrack and I think it really makes the movie. And of course you can't when it comes to low budget and getting the most bang for your buck. You can't do any better than Linda Cohen as your music supervisor. You can. It was our fifth movie together, so I'm looking to do it for to do it again. Yeah. I am a huge Linda Cohen fan. Oh my god. Oh. Her work is just fabulous. And any any indie filmmakers that are asking me about you know music is like go to Linda Cohen first. She's amazing. She's great. So it, you know what what did you take away from this film? You personally because this is so different than your other film. It is different. Although I I just um, yeah I just directed two romantic comedies in a row after I produced this movie. So that got me to um, sort of figuring out like sorry about that how to. Um, how to take everything I learned from Finn and how to do a comedy and put it into my own career and that was really priceless. Susan, thank you so much. Congratulations. Nice meeting you. Officially, I will I will see you at the Spirit Awards. You will. Okay.